This is question number 8 from GS paper 3 of mains 2021 examination. Question is discuss about the vulnerability of India to earthquake related hazards. Give examples including the salient features of major disasters caused by earthquakes in different parts of India during last three decades. First part of the question is about vulnerability or in simple words about possibility of earthquake related hazards in India. In answer, first I write different risk zones of India on the basis of vulnerability to earthquake. I have uh, also mentioned the earthquake related hazards in uh, hilly areas and uh, in the coastal areas. Uh, in the second part, I have given examples of uh, major earthquakes in last three decades along with salient features of these earthquakes. Now let's see the answer. India's more than 50% of land is prone to earthquakes. On the basis of past record of seismicity, the Bureau of Indian Standards has divided India into four categories. These are Zone 5, Zone 4, Zone 3 and Zone 2. Out of these, Zone 5 is most prone to earthquakes and includes parts of Gujarat, Assam and Arunachal Pradesh. Zone 2 has least risk of strong earthquakes. In India, almost entire Himalayan belt and Indo-Gangetic region is prone to earthquakes. The main cause of earthquake in these regions is the movement of Indian plate towards Eurasian plate at a rate of about 47 mm per year. In hilly regions of India, earthquakes cause landslides and avalanche which cause damage. Landslides may block the rivers which cause flooding. India is also prone to reservoir induced earthquakes. Water in the reservoir of dams exerts extreme pressure on fissures and faults at bottom or near these structures. India's coastal cities are prone to tsunamis triggered by undersea earthquakes. Now second part of the question. Salient features of major earthquakes in India in last three decades. Uttarkashi first is Uttarkashi earthquake and this happened in the 1991. It caused death of more than 1000 persons. Most of deaths occurred due to collapse of stone masonry homes. The magnitude of this earthquake was 6.8. Next is Latur earthquake. Latur is in Maharashtra. This earthquake happened in 1993, it caused death of about uh, 1,800 persons. The earthquake was of intensity 8 to 9. Severe damage was limited to areas of radius just within 10 km. Although Latur falls in the low risk zone of earthquakes, but still it gives lesson that earthquakes can strike anywhere. Next is Chimoli. Now it is in Uttarakhand. Uh, this earthquake happened in 1999. And this caused death of more than 100 persons. Most of damage occurred due to landslides which destroyed homes and shops built on the slopes. On January 26, uh, 2001, Bhuj earthquake in Gujarat caused death of more than 10,000 uh, 10, persons. Thousands of buildings were completely destroyed. This earthquake was of magnitude 7.7 .7 and its intensity was 10. Due to high vulnerability to earthquakes, India needs to vigorously work on town planning, raising building parameters, public awareness and rescue plans. Thank you.